this new price gouging law is completely responsible for all the shortage that, shortages that you're seeing at the pump uh, over the last few days. Uh, gas station owners are afraid to raise their price to the necessary price to make supply and demand equal. So what's happening is that they're selling out uh, at an uh, unreasonably low price and uh, shutting their doors and causing shortages. There's never been gasoline shortages in history without a price control law. And right now we have a price control law, and it's, it's uh, hampering the market from doing its job. Some people may say, wait a minute, high gas prices, that's a bad thing. Anything that keeps the gas prices down is a good thing. Uh, the choice is not between gasoline with high prices and gasoline with low prices. It's a choice between gasoline with high prices and no gasoline. The point is, is that in, I've seen small towns around this area where there is absolutely no gas available. And the price is $3.69 a gallon. In other words, it's way too low. Um, the fact is, is that you want these higher prices to curb uh, what customers naturally do in this situation, fill up, and not just fill up their car, one car, but two cars, three cars, uh, uh, gallon tanks that they have uh, for their lawnmowers and all those kinds of things. There is hoarding that goes on in these kinds of situations and high prices have the function of getting people to conserve. This is a very silly law that's harming consumers.